Hey everybody, it's Thomas with Get Out Arizona and you are watching another amazing episode of On Trail. And if you could see that behind me guys, Red Rock could only mean one thing. We're in Sedona, Arizona once again and I am super excited to be at the Robber's Roost. This is going to be great. The cave, the thing that you see on Google all the time when you look up great places to go in Sedona. We're finally here and we're going to hike it. Now this is a relatively short hike. We drove right up to the trailhead and it's about a mile and a half to get to the actual rock formation on the other side where the caves are and about a mile and a half back. Figure after additional walking, we're looking maybe close to five miles, but you know I'm gonna give you accurate statistics when we're all said and done. The weather is beautiful. It's about 78 degrees and I couldn't ask for a better afternoon. Guys, I'm super excited to share this with you. <coughs> and I'm not even gonna edit the cough out. There's so much we're gonna explore these next few days while we're here in Sedona. On the bike, hiking, it's gonna be amazing, guys. Super, super excited. So, as we're getting ready to get started, get some great video, some great photo, some drone video. What do we always say, guys, seriously? Be kind to yourself and others. Be amazing, Stuart's on that trail. And we have to ask, oh my Lord, as if it was a really a legitimate question. What are you waiting for? Get out Arizona. Guys, it's time for that next adventure. Let's get going. All right, guys, well, so far so good. Um, I'm hoping the drone's getting some good footage <laughs> to share with you guys, kind of give you a different perspective. Now, so far the trail, I wouldn't say has been rough, a little technical with uh, some of the rocks, um, some of the loose dirt. Remember, we always tell you to be mindful. Safety first, guys. Nothing's ever worth an, worth an injury. So as I say that and try not to slip and break my ass, but how many times does that happen? So, all right guys, let's keep pushing forward. All right guys, so it's definitely flattened out at this point, which is nice. Uh, you might be wondering, hey Thomas, why are you wearing your glasses? You never wear your glasses. Well, I gotta see the controller <laughs> on the phone to control the drone, so it is what it is. So uh, we're not too far off, which is great. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna pan around so you can get that view behind me. Are you guys freaking kidding me? <laughs> Seriously. Uh, and you wonder why we come out here and do this stuff? Well, there's your answer, baby. So let's keep moving. All right, guys, so we pretty much made it. We're like right here, and we got some people putting on a show, which is awesome. Very, very festive. So we're gonna go ahead and try to navigate the drone and get some better shots of uh, everybody. Look at this great group of people over here. Man. We thought, we thought you got lost along the way, what happened? Super festive. Yeah, you're late. <laughs> I had to work. 
Still got to shake that money maker. All right. All right, guys, so as you can see from the view that I have behind me, we have reached our final destination. The hike was easy peasy, and I would say anybody from any skill level can make it, as long as you use a little prudence in a couple areas. Now, I'm gonna pan back here, and you're gonna see the actual money shot, and there's everybody who's already here having a great time. First time on Get Out Arizona, we've had other people than me on a hiking trail, so this is a great occasion. And I'm gonna pan over here, so you can see the formation that we have. You can actually hike this all the way around. Now, if you're not skilled or don't have a person to claim your dead body, I would suggest not to. It gets kind of treacherous. Remember what happened when we were over <laughs> at Cow Patties that one day when I was with Wyatt, okay? So you always wanna use better judgment. Remember, an injury is never worth getting to a spot you're not ready to get to. But again, guys, oh my God, what a day. What a day and what a view. And what do we always say at this point? Be kind to yourself and others. Be amazing stewards on that trail. Lead by example, my friends. And we have to ask seriously, what are you waiting for? Get out Arizona. We will see you on that next adventure. Take care, everybody, and have a great day. setting sun and we got a cave right behind us which I'll uh, pan to here in just a second and uh, again it's absolutely gorgeous and you know this is a little bit of a supplemental um, the group of people that I met when I got here and you guys saw them amazing just super awesome people <sighs> I can't say what a great day it was in this um, you know the week's just barely started and dare I say it's gonna be the highlight of the week it's one of the reasons why we're out here, you know, you know, and, and what do we say during those tenants? Be kind to yourself and others. Be amazing stewards on the trail. Seriously, guys, this is not just lip service uh, that I give because I think it's good and it's a great catchphrase. Um, I love being outdoors. I love sharing my adventures with you. And um, to me, it means something. So this is meeting this group uh, this afternoon, this evening. Um, just proof positive, you know, the day was meant to happen the way it did, and uh, this adventure was meant to happen the way it did, and, uh, you know, I can, I can have a good, happy heart in that, so um, I love you guys, I thank you for the support, um, and yeah, what else can I say? I um, already did the closing, so this will be closing number two. You know what goes in this spot, so I won't bother, I'll just tell you guys to have an amazing day, wherever you're at, whatever you might be doing when you see this video, and we'll See you again soon. All right, so a little bit of full disclosure, guys. Um, you're gonna see video from yesterday and <laughs> the day after. And I know yesterday doesn't mean much uh, as far as that goes. I think the date's the 26th, so yesterday was the 25th. Um, the reason being is I ran out of light and there were some things that, you know, on the way back, I'm like, oh, I really wanna get that and show that in the video and everything. I think you guys would enjoy it. So I'm back. You get some more drone footage gonna explore a couple different areas around the roost and uh, see what we can't find today but just wanted to be up front with you you're gonna see <laughs> I'll try to make it you know as uh, congruent as possible but no promises so let's uh, let's go see what we can't find on uh, rustlers robbers roost rustlers roost robbers roost day two so, we're gonna call this future me. <laughs> uh, instead of day two or version two. So, we are going a different direction and we are sweeping counterclockwise around the roost. Um, there looks to be two other larger openings. I wouldn't necessarily call them caves, but I'd like to see if this trail actually heads towards those and uh, see what the vantage point is from there. So. Let's uh, keep moving and find out.
All right, guys, so we're still cruising around the south side <laughs> of the roost. And uh, man, just, it's too easy in Sedona, you know? And if you know what I mean, you know what I mean. Uh, and it just doesn't get any better. So we're making our way around. Probably at some point we're going to try to cut up towards the top and get it all the way on the peak. The uh, wind's really whipping. I'm sure you can hear it in the audio. I still think I might try to fly up the drone though and get some footage so you guys can get a good perspective of uh, the surrounding area. So let's keep moving forward. guys the wind's blowing the drones flying and I'm trying to multitask <laughs> uh, you can see where we came from and that gorgeous view and it's about to get a whole lot better So this is ending number three. Think of it like the Lord of the Rings. We thought it was gonna end and it didn't end. And this is future me talking because you've already seen the ending from the past me. Um, <laughs> gosh, the, Sedona, the adventures, are you kidding me? You saw that additional footage. It was like the director's cut of Wrestler's Roost as I pan around here so you could see everything behind me. Guys, I love doing these videos and I love sharing these with you, seriously. It's such a blessing to be out here. I feel grateful every day for my health to be able to come out here and do the things I do. And I tell everybody that I friggin' love my life. And I do, <laughs> it's just, you know, who could complain? I'm out here, it's absolutely beautiful. And I get to hike and explore and do all these amazing things, guys. So on that note, I hope you enjoyed the additional footage. You guys know what to do, like, subscribe, all that other good stuff. And once again, I'm gonna tell you, be kind to yourself and others. Be amazing stewards out on that trail. And we have to ask, as I point this out, are you kidding me? My hand, there we go. What are you waiting for, guys? Seriously, get out Arizona. We will see you on that next adventure. Take, take care, guys. Thanks for sticking around for the extra footage.